Hi, welcome to PO Sports Talk. I'm Lizzie Arbogast, and the regular season is over and the postseason is upon us. We have two area teams in the postseason. We'll start with Chambersburg at Central York, and then we'll have Shippensburg is hosting Spring Grove. Chambersburg will travel to Central York on Friday night, starting at 7 o'clock. Um, Central York is 7-3, and three. Chambersburg is 6-4. and four. Uh, They only got one common opponent this year, and that's Cumberland Valley. Now, they both lost to Cumberland Valley. Central York was slightly closer. Um, it's sort of hard to compare the two teams. Talking with Chambersburg coach Mark Saunders, he says the teams are very similar. They both have people that can make big plays. They both have decent defenses. And so this should be a, a pretty good game. Now, the one big question mark for the Trojans is Jamal Pickett. He sprained his ankle in the first quarter of last week's game and talked to him this week. He said he's about 75%. That was on Tuesday. So we'll see if he comes back. If he doesn't, there are always people that, that can step up in his place. We've got Jordan Brown. We've got Kellen Williams. We've got Tay Charles, who's been doing well. Taylor Tolbert's been doing well. So there's, there's plenty of weapons for the Trojans. So this should be a good game for both teams, I believe. Now, uh, also on Friday night, Shippensburg is going to host Spring Grove at uh, 7 o'clock start time. Spring Grove is 7-3. and three. Shippensburg is 9-1. and one. They also only have one uh, common opponent, and that was Northeastern. Now, that was Shippensburg, Shippensburg's only loss this year, um, where Spring Grove actually beat them 10-7. to seven. Both games were very close, um, so this should be an interesting matchup. Um, Again, Shippensburg is going to be helped along by the return of Tony Johnson, who has been out with some nagging injuries, and he had the flu. He hasn't really played since the Greencastle game uh, in Week 7, I believe. Um, but I talked to him on Monday. He said by Friday he would be 100%. He'll be ready to go um, tonight. So I think this has the makeup of being a big shootout. Uh, both teams have very potent offenses. Both team defenses are also decent. But this, is, this could be a shootout for sure. So thank you for joining us and enjoy the games.